With the coronavirus outbreak, you might find yourself scrambling to support remote workers who haven't been remote before. Stay tuned to learn some of the steps you can take to make sure that your customer and personnel data stays safe and secure, even with remote employees. I'm Don Pizzetta, and this is a critical update from IT Pro TV. All right, one of the first things that we need to consider is whether people need to use remote machines at all. When someone is working from home, if they don't have a company machine, their home computer is a risk. Consider leveraging remote desktop technologies, technologies like Go to My PC or Log Me In that can quickly and easily be deployed and allow your workers to access their desktop from their home computer. So they're basically using the computer at work but just using the monitor on their computer at home. That makes sure the data stays in the company where we know that it's safe. Another thing to consider is to leverage technologies like encryption. We know that people can break in and steal a computer and the hard drive goes with it. Home computers are typically not encrypted. Technologies like Microsoft's BitLocker are not enabled by default. Even Apple's File Vault is only enabled by default in some of the newer installs. So you need to make sure that they're encrypted either by hand or by leveraging centralized software. Speaking of centralized software, you might want to consider rolling out some kind of malware to those home machines, to, or malware protection, not malware, uh, to protect those machines from malware infection. Something like Sophos Intercept X is actually a great solution that does antivirus and can test for encryption and make sure those drives are encrypted and backup keys are stored centrally. Those are quick and easy things that can be rolled out to secure those home machines to ensure that data is safe. And then lastly, consider the network. They're using a home network that's usually cable or DSL, some kind of community broadband that might be moderately secured by the ISP, but is typically not as secure as our work environment. Consider leveraging a VPN. If you have Cisco, Juniper, F5 appliances, they typically support VPNs, but you can quickly and easily roll out an open source VPN server, like an open SSL, uh, you can use OpenVPN, uh, WireGuard, all of those are quick, easy, open source solutions you can roll out, have people VPN into the office, and now they're using a network that you know is secure. So those are all some various steps that we can take to ensure that people are working securely and safely even when they're at home. Now I cover those pretty quickly. If you want to learn more, be sure to tune in for our webinar that's coming up on March 26th. It's Stay Secure While Working Remotely. You can sign up for free over at uh, itpro.tv slash webinars. Be sure to check that one out. Also check out our playlist here on YouTube for more critical updates and be sure to subscribe to the IT Pro TV channel. I'm Don Pazette, and thanks for watching this critical update.